The cone is very similar to the cylinder. So we did the cylinder last class. We're going to do the cone today, finish it up. Should take us all of 10 minutes. Similar to the cone, there's a little highlight line on one side, and then it goes gradually four, three, two, one to the other. Same thing here. So our darkest value on the form itself will go right about here. And because the form is triangular, or goes to a point, our shadows will be rather triangular as well. Start out the same way, hold your pencil back a little bit, and lightly move your hatch lines up towards the top. Crosshatch go in the other direction. And then slowly move towards the light source. Lightly cross hatch the other way. A little bit of a highlight right here on that edge as the light wraps around. A little bit more highlight on this side. Four, three, two, one. Dark gray, middle gray, light gray, and white. Your shadow will be dark like a number four or five go in the direction of the shadow at first and then move horizontally second again don't go up and down vertically you don't want to appear as if your shadow is falling off the page you still want to have the illusion that this is sitting on a surface a floor table whatever If you start to lose the edge of your form, redefine it. You don't want to lose that in the shadow. You want the shadow and the form to remain separate. If your values change too suddenly and you start to see the lines between the values, then, then just continue to use your pencil. Go over it lightly and those areas should disappear. Feathering once again, one direction. Lift your pencil point up off the paper. Mm -hmm. 
Again, I'm not trying to do too much blending because I know many of you don't have your blenders yet, but I'm just going to touch the shadow a little bit. Again, don't use your finger. That makes a mess. I'm going to do a little bit in the darkest area, just lightly pulling up towards the highlight line and then I'm going to leave it. Okay. All right, so that finishes it for the cylinder. We'll also finish it for the assignment. 